everyone, Tim Brown, welcome back to my Apple podcast. As you know, I'm excited about the upcoming operating systems. I just, just did a great review uh, on Sierra and how Siri is integrated into the new operating system. And I also want to show you a, a very nice feature. It's called Universal Clipboard. Basically, you can copy an image or some kind of file from the desktop and then paste it into your iOS device and or vice versa. Now, I have found some inconsistencies in terms of how you do it, but let me just show you a, a demonstration of how this function typically works. So what I'm going to do is actually go to my Mac and I'm going to copy an image from my Mac and I'm going to bring it into my iPad in several different ways. Okay, so I have this image open in my picture folder and I'm going to go ahead and do a command A to select all and then do a command C to copy this image while it's open. So command A, command C. Okay, I just copied that image. It is now on my computer's clipboard. But since the, the clipboard is now universal, that means that I'm now saving it to an area that can be accessed from any device because it's universal. So let's see exactly what they mean by this. So let's start with the notes application first. So I'm gonna go ahead and open up the notes application and start a new document. And I'm gonna press and hold and so I can bring up the menu that brings up paste and I'm gonna click paste. And it's processing it. Obviously, it's reading something that's been copied and it's trying to paste something into my document. And what do you know? The exact same image that I copied from my Mac is now into a note that I just opened on my iPad. Now, let's see if this can work in other ways. So I'm going to go ahead and find a photo editor. Uh, I use a photo editor called Leonardo. And Le Leonardo has a feature built in, a clipboard feature built in when starting a new document. So I'm going to go ahead and open Leonardo and in the top right corner, you can select the plus symbol to start a new document by bringing a photo in from your library, starting an, starting an empty document or just starting one by adding an image from your clipboard. So I'm going to pull from that universal clipboard that where I just copied an image from my Mac and I'm going to use that to start a new project in Leonardo on my iPad. So I'm going to select clipboard. And voila, it brings that image right into Leonardo. And now I can go in on my iOS device and start adding special effects right inside the Leonardo app on my iPad. Okay, let's try another Apple application. How about Keynote? Keynote is one application that I would use a lot if I wanted to quickly bring images into it uh, without having to go directly to my photo library. Uh, so let me go ahead and open up Keynote. And I have a blank presentation set up and I want to go ahead and bring an image into my presentation. But instead of just doing it the typical way by hitting the plus symbol and then going through the various different options that are available, uh, largely bringing in images from my library, I'm just going to press and hold on the screen with my finger and bring up that menu and then select paste. And what do you know? I was able to also bring that image right inside a keynote presentation. So those are several different ways in which you can use Universal Clipboard starting with your Mac and or vice versa and pasting things right into your document. Now, before I go, let me just go ahead and try this one more time by copying and pasting something from my iPad and then adding it to a document on my Mac. Okay, I'm now gonna go inside the Photos app and I'm gonna grab an image out of my photo library uh, that's in my camera roll and I'm going to copy it and I'm going to paste it into a document that I have set up on my Mac uh, using the application Pixelmator for the desktop. So let me go ahead and open up Photos and I'm going to go ahead and find me an image to copy. Uh, this is a, actually a collage that I created. So I'm just going to go ahead and use the Select feature. Where I'm going to select this feature and then I'm going to hit the Share button. And usually I like to use AirDrop uh, for when I'm doing stuff like this, but I wanted to, to paste this right in the Pixelmator. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down to the bottom and just select the Copy option. Then I'm going to hit cancel. Then I'm going to go back to the Mac and see if that copied image from my iPad was saved to the universal clipboard that will now enable me to paste it in the pixel banner. So let's go ahead and check this out. So I'm just going to go ahead and just use the short command key, command V, and see if this image is pasted into Pixelmator. And as you can see, the Mac is reading that there is definitely something that has been saved to the clipboard and it's now gradually processing that image, and voila, it came right into Pixelmator. My name is Tim Brown. Thanks for tuning in for another episode. Check me out next time.